Week five, we're going to enjoy the next Cheltenham with the two mile novices chase. And at the top, we've got today is to do for Joshua Sutherland, Varsity Lord, Jim Murray, the Little Women, Joshua Sutherland, Bally Colin Ramius, Matt Cooper, Eternal Wizard, Darren Thompson, Hartforth Bianco, Thomas Rogers, Near Dude, CDJ Liggett. Opulence, Leon Van Rensburg, Quail Sketch, David Robertson, Wild Thing, Derek Hinton, Consuelo Skirt, David Robertson, and Seeking the Stars for David Hooley. So 12 in in this week's opener. You're at HQ and ready to go. And away we go. And heading off towards the first. It's going to be Wild Thing that's going to take away. We're the lead. And there's a four at the very first one. Consuelo Skirt is down. So Consuelo Skirt... Consuelo skirt down at the first and as they get over the second and they're all safely over the second with Wild Thing continuing to lead then two lengths to the good with Wild on a track opulence seeking the stars down this near side between the two of them the two Joshua Sutherland horses to dare is to do the one just in front looking towards the back Jim Murray's varsity lord the only remaining grey in the field is the back marker as they get to the third which is in front of the stands and Jim Murray's varsity lord was down on its nose there as they take the fence it'll be the last on the next circuit they all get over that one safely so they've already negotiated four of the 13 fences then we've lost one of them already as they swing left-handed and out for a complete circuit of this Presbury Park course and it's Wild Thing who's in the lead by about four lengths to Seeking the Stars is moved through to second as they take the fence away from the stands all safely over that one with Bally Colin Ramius now uh, just dropping to the back as I'm at 12 lengths first to last at the moment Wild Thing has got a lead of about three lengths to in second place Quail Sketch on the outside of Seeking the Stars then comes the little women as they get to the sixth oh, a mistake there by the CDJ Liggett trained horse which is near dude and that's just dropped towards the rear of the field with that mistake I take the water now then and Wild Thing continues to lead the little woman is now second with Seeking the Stars and Tadere to do Hartforth Bianco making a forward move on the outside. Eternal Wizard is also getting a bit closer as is Jim Murray's Varsity Lord Kutch upon the inside by Quail Sketch has seen that get yeah, back up into a prominent position and Opulence is now the one who's dropped to the back as they take the ninth. And the pace is pretty hot and they're making their way towards the next then and Wild Thing is two lengths clear of the little woman in second coil sketch seems to be going well in third to dare to do half fourth bianco next near dude has made some ground as a faller there a really bad looking fall for seeking the stars for david hooley so that one's out of the race now as well and as they race downhill and head towards the business end of the race and the final three fences in this one then and it's wild thing who's still just about in the lead from the little women and quail sketch they're being chased by half wolf bianco and near do then to dare is to do opulence and eternal wizard not far behind them bally colin ramis is trying to come round the back as they take the third from home the grave last is going to try and swing wide but it's still wild thing who's got the lead been in the lead all the way and leads by about a length to the little women and quail sketch opulence He's looming on the outside. Half of Bianca in a big race. Also coming through with a big looking run. Now he's near dude on this near side. And also the grey is coming through. Varsity Lord as they race down towards the second last. And it's all changes. The long time leader. One thing drops tamely away. And now it's three in a line. Quail sketch. Little women. Half of Bianca over the second last mistake by Varsity Lord. Here comes Eternal Wizard in the white sleeves. Now coming through the challenge over the final fence. They go. And it's Quail sketch on the inside. He jumped in the better. And Quail sketch is getting away from it. The better. But he's being challenged by the little women. It's Quail Sketch and the little women. Here comes Eternal Woods and Tadere to do Opulence. He's trying to run on as well. Quail Sketch is hanging on in the lead. Quail Sketch is in front, racing towards the line now and just hangs on. Quail Sketch wins it from the little women and Opulence and then Eternal Woods and Hartford of Bianco. And all the way back to the long time leader who was the last one to finish. And Quail Sketch takes it so. Quail Sketch the winner then for David Robertson. His other one fell at the first, but this one took the race nicely. The Little Women was second for Joshua Sutherland. The Eternal Wizard for Darren Thompson was third. To Darius to do Joshua Sutherland fourth. And Opulence for Leon van Rinsburg was fifth. <laughs>